Hey, what's up guys? I'm Lauv, and these are 17 of my favorite things. One, uh, denim jackets. Yeah, definitely denim jackets. Two, sad songs. I don't know, sad songs just feel good. They kind of like, a nice sad song is kind of like a nice blanket, you know what I'm saying? Maybe Fix You by Coldplay. Probably like one of my favorite sad songs. Number three, sad movies. Or actually, okay, beautifully tragic movie. Like, I don't know, like Midnight in Paris. If it's sappy, I'd probably like it. Number four, um, really bad memes that nobody understands. Like, okay, like progression memes, like you know the ones where it's like, it's like, I don't know, it's like x-ray vision of a guy's head and it's like it progresses, like it takes a phrase and then it progresses it more and more complicated. Number five would be cold brew coffee, especially with almond milk. Cold brew with almond milk, really good. Uh, six, Funyuns. I think it doesn't need any explanation. Funyuns are just dope. Seven, chilaquiles, one of my favorite Mexican dishes. Uh, there was a Mexican restaurant I worked at when I was in college that I still go to every time I go to New York and they have the best chilaquiles in the world. Eight, SpongeBob. I once had a dream when I was a kid that I was actually in an episode of SpongeBob and then I woke up and I was really sad. I mean, I guess just always SpongeBob. Nine, the song Down by the Bay by Rafi. Just check it out, it's really good. 10, my mom, hi mom. 11, sesame ginger salad dressing. Just the best salad dressing there is. 12, Air Force Ones. White and black, just classic Air Force Ones, really comfy. 13, track pants. Like I used to wear a lot of skinny jeans, but I've definitely been more so on like clothes that are actually comfortable. So, loose fit. 14, Friends. And I'm like super behind. I just started watching Friends like a year ago, even though, I don't know, what is it? like two decades old? But yeah, friends, I'm like still haven't made my way through and I'm like, yeah, a couple decades behind, so. 15 tattoos. I like especially like small words. Like I got a little word here, a little word here, like small things. The most recent one I got is just the word why. Um, I just think it's kind of, at least for me, like the most important question to ask myself and to ask in general to make sure like I'm going through life and doing things that are actually like genuine to me and like that I believe in. I have one that says TM, like a trademark, that's basically just like a, a weird meme inside joke. And then I have one up here that's coordinates that I won't tell you what they're for, but they're coordinates. 16, ramen. I've been cooking ramen for years. It's one of the finer things I can cook. Some good, maybe some good beef ramen with some sriracha, maybe an egg, maybe some frozen vegetables if you're gonna be really fancy. Maybe some chicken in the beef ramen, which is probably like the most atrocious thing to anybody who's a vegetarian or a vegan, I'm sorry. And number 17, Luigi's Mansion. I, I don't know, it's just, it's just like this, I have like the forever imprinted the sound of the ghosts as you're like getting, as you're like sucking them in the vacuum cleaner. It's a really creepy sound, but it was like a, one of my favorite games growing up. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, I just put out my full project playlist called I Met You When I Was 18, so go check that out and uh, I'll see you guys soon.